Hello everyone. So today I was uh, trying to do something on my Jira instance, my test Jira instance, and I noticed uh, this uh, new interface. Now at Lushen announced this, I think uh, sometime last year, I think it was in October, November. It has been a while. I mean, they announced it and I think they opened up some kind of a beta program where they invited users to try it out. I think using some Chrome extension, something like that. I remember, I think it was uh, it was also posted on the community. But today I noticed on my one of my Jira instance that I have a new UI. So I thought, you know, before I do a bit more uh, deep dive, I, I thought, you know, I'll just do it along with you. So I noticed uh, of course, this uh, menu that used to be there on top, it is no longer there on top. It is basically on the left hand side. Now, uh, I'll give you my honest feedback, like what I feel so far. So to be honest, uh, I think I missed the menu on top. And I also know that there is a big search box, which, uh, which is helpful. I think uh, it is always good to know. But uh, I would still prefer if I have few items on top purely because I'm used to it and I know it will it will not be a big problem because I know how Jira works. I can always, you know, find out where to go. Now, as a Jira user, when you're working on your uh, <coughs> projects, whenever you're working on your boards, there are few places where you need to go quite regularly. Now, we, know, we, we all know that... Uh, on Jira Data Center, there used to be, I mean, there still is, by the way, this option where you can go to your issues and uh, it will go to, it will take you to the issue navigator and filter. On Jira Cloud, it is a bit different. You need to perform search and then you need, need to click on this view all issues. Then you will reach the issue navigator. Now, I was uh, looking for uh, the filters and uh, there is a separate section which I can see. So if I click on it, I can click on search for issue. So it is not bad. I mean, it is okay. I think uh, it will just take, uh, you know, few weeks, maybe few days, and I'm sure I'll get used to it. So a so few, few things that I wanted to, you know, check. Of course, there is no top uh, navigation or menu. You can also collapse the sidebar. And the way you collapse the sidebar is uh, your uh, left square bracket which is, you know, which is a familiar uh, shortcut. And uh, the first option is your work. And then we have something called as recent. And I think this recent is good because it will show you, I think, uh, the last place, or I believe the issue. I'm not really sure if, you, if, if it will also show the issue. Let us click on the project and let us go to one of the issue. So this is one of my issue. I'll do something here. So just just to record some activity let us say i move the status to done and i will okay let me select the resolution oh come on F time spent one hour update okay there is something wrong okay no so i'm i'm now back to my um nav navigation and if i go to this recent now um, I was expecting the issue, which is fine. I mean, not a, not really a big thing. We all recent items. Okay. So I think, um, I mean, if you're on Jira data center, there is an option where you can click on uh, the issues and it will show you the last issue that you worked on. For, for, for this, you need to go to the search on top. So I think it is not bad so far. I mean, I'll get used to it. Then of course you have star items, which is, you know, handy and everything is collapsible, I guess, or uh, it will not show up unless you click on it. Of course you can collapse the whole sidebar and this, your apps, we don't really use it to be honest that much. I don't really think there is a need uh, for uh, this uh, icon here. Or maybe, maybe there is a need, I, I don't know. I, I don't really use this option to switch between my Jira instances or go to um, another application like Bitbucket, for example, and all the links are here, which is fine. But uh, you also have the option to go to your apps. And I guess it will also show you all the apps that you have access to, or 
maybe you know apps that you want to configure then of course you have plans which i don't have on this instance then we have projects and uh, by default it is showing me all the projects so okay so the way it works is you need to click on it and then it will expand and if you click on it, click on it again it will uh, collapse and uh, then we have filters i actually refer to filters quite a lot okay you can also hide from the sidebar which is good maybe i want to hide uh, operations or oh, sorry hide from sidebar and what if i want to go back to it so okay so you need to click on the more and uh, customize sidebar and this is good i like that and I think I made one video last year, sometime last year, where I mentioned that Jira UI should be a bit more configurable. And this is what I, I think Atlassian, um, I think they have done here. And I, and I like that. So you can also do it in one go. You can actually move these items. And I'm not using assets. Maybe I want to move dashboards on top. This is wonderful. I like that. Good work. And um, now, and I'm not I'm not sure if this is only for me or for everyone, right? This is also that I want to know. I think, okay, show, hide, or reorder navigation items. Only you will see these changes, okay? So it's basically a personal thing, which is good. Good work, Atlassian, if you're watching this video. I know some of you watch my videos, and uh, I want to say good work. I, I like this. Okay, this is good. And I think other, apart from this, all good. I'll just, uh, I think I need to give a uh, good work. Atlassian for the new UI. And uh, Ravi Sagar. Okay, send feedback. I think if, uh, if you like something, then you should definitely appreciate it. And if you don't like something, then, then you should definitely talk about it. That, that That is what I try to do. Okay, so I think overall I'm happy with this. And what if I go to a project? Is there any change there? Or if I go to the list of projects? Uh, I think uh, so far, I, I think the only change, or the, the main change here is the navigation or the menu. So if I go to the list of, what if I want to look at all the projects? Manage projects, okay. Right, 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 okay. So you can go back to products, you can go back to system, you can go back to issues or apps. Okay, I like this. I think it is, I think something happened, but anyways, I think it is good so far. So if I go to one of my project, maybe my company managed project. Oh, so it is also showing the boards under your projects. Okay, this is good. I, I like this. I like this. I think uh, when you and you can also create a board from here, which is great. And you can go to the project settings. You can go to ah, delete project may not be a good idea because it can be. Uh, I mean, you can just do it by mistake. And you can also add people to your uh, project from here. So this is. And can you only only do it when you are within the project? What if I go back to your work? Ah, okay. So I can do it from the main uh, basically from anywhere you can go to project settings you can go to archive so good i like this so yeah that is all that is all i wanted to do today i just wanted to quickly look at the um new ui and it is definitely i think jira cloud ui has changed few times in the past and uh, i think uh, i think this change is probably the best change so far all right that is it. That is all I wanted to talk about in this video. I hope you enjoyed watching this video and you learned something new. Thank you very much. Bye-bye.